If you've been tired of people quitting on you in the park, quitting on you in the wreck, and you keep getting stuck with AI, I have a solution for you that might help making playing with the AI a little less painful. And you can start to use the AI more effectively. If you're trying to level up your badges and still meet some of those season objectives, you can use it in your My Career games as well. Now, when you're playing with randoms, trust me, I understand. It can be very frustrating because a lot of the time, no one's on the same page, people are just running around, or as we all know, you have your straight ball hogs that take a shot every single time that they touch the ball. And once your team starts losing, they quit, and you're stuck with the AI. And the AI doesn't always have the best basketball IQ when it comes to offense. In the defense, yeah, it's not the best, but they still can make some pretty solid stops when the momentum's on their side. Now back to the AI's offense. Fortunately for us, you can control this. And I'm not talking about just calling plays or a pick and roll. Of course, you can always pull up the menu and call plays for specific players to get open in my career, but that does take some time and some memorization. But with some practice, of course, again, it can become second nature. But what if you could become like Goat James and tell people to cut and get open on the fly? In your My Career, if you open up the main menu, then go down to 2K Tips, change over to Passing. If you look at Lead to Basket Pass, you can see that you can tell whichever AI that you select to cut to the basket on the fly. Now this may not seem like a lot, but trust me, this was a real game changer for me. And I'm not a big fan of playing my career games until now. Think about in the wreck. When you get triple teamed because your team quit and you're just sitting in the corner and everybody's sitting around you, you can tell the AI to cut to the basket, make that quick pass, and get an easy bucket. You have a lot more control over what the AI does now. On top of the basket cuts, you can tell specific players to get open, do handoff passes, give given goes. You just have to play around with all the options. Also, if you have not maxed out all your playmaking badges, this is the way. And hopefully you're on a team with somebody like Giannis or LeBron who are both pretty much unstoppable when they cut to the basket. You do still have to be careful because those lanes do get picked off from time to time. So just make sure that you make the smart decision. Of course, when you're calling the pick and roll for you just telling somebody to cut from the corner, just make sure you're keeping your eye on the lane when you make that pass. So let me know down in the comments, what do you do when your team quits on you? Do you just quit the game too? Or do you stick it out with the AI and still try to get some of that XP? Anyway, that's it for now. If you enjoyed this one and learned something new, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button, bang on that notification bell, and I'll catch you in the next one. Hey man, I don't got a lot of time, just so you know. Okay, so I'll get right to it. How much would you say you contributed to this win? A lot. You know, I got going, and when I get going, it gives my team a spark. They feed off of my energy. Okay, so they play better when you play better. Mm -hmm. You don't ever receive their help. <laughs> what? <laughs> man, of course they help me. This is a team.